Aquarius here at Post 9 taking a look at the, I'm told, the pickup and short sell it. Well, you know, Paul, let's call this, you viewers asked for this, so I'm going to try to do the work. A number of people have written to me over the last several weeks asking about short interest here on the New York Stock Exchange and what does it mean. A number of people, Paul, think that because short interest, or so it has been reported, is at record highs, or they call it record highs, that's going to create another buying surge later into this year as people come to the shorts. So I went back and looked at some numbers. Let's take a look here. If you look at the last, this is through 2012, April 30th, uh, there was 13 billion shares short at the New York Stock Exchange. June 15th, 14.7, short interest through August 31st, the last day that we have, down to 13.7 billion. So a billion shares have been bought in in terms of listed member firm short interest. I want to bring up a picture. Take a look at this, this picture, and I'm not going to say this is the record high in terms of short interest was actually 18 billion shares. And if you take a look at this specific chart, the reason I wanted to bring this up is very relevant. Let's go to the little reveal here. What this picture is right here was 2000 to 2008, and why I think it's so important. Take a look here. This was the S&P 500 peak. Short interest had essentially gone from 4 billion shares up to approximately 12 billion shares. When the S&P 500 peaked in 2000, at the end of 2007, 2008, short interest actually increased during that period. So, conclusion here. Conclusion is you cannot draw the conclusion that just because short interest is at significant record high levels, that it means anything for the S&P 500. Because if you go back to the most recent period, four years ago, short interest, record highs, S&P 500 peak, short interest continued to go up through the collapse. People were selling right into that weakness in 2008. Are you suggesting the peak has already passed us or not? I'm not suggesting anything. <laughs> I'm <laughs> simply <laughs> suggesting that many people have suggested to me that because short interest at 13.7 billion shares, you're going to have to see people buy in. Maybe go down 11 billion shares, creating the next leg up in the market. There is a strong thesis out there saying that. I just wanted to point out, going back to these pictures, if you look at where we were in 2008, I thought it was somewhat surprising that we jumped from 14 billion up to 18 billion at that time. Yeah. And I'm sure when I get up to the floor, the floor yeah, a lot of these guys are going to have a strong opinion <laughs> on it either way. That's cool.